Hi guys, so I'm back with another video. I apologize for the huge delay in between my last video. My schedule has been very hectic, so I didn't have time to really sit down and edit and upload. Today I'm going to do the video that some of you have been waiting for, which is on brown skin, and I hope you guys enjoy it. First, I'm going to wipe off her face with a makeup wipe as usual. Like I said in the previous video, you always want to make sure your client's face is clean. Next, I'm going to take a moisturizer and my primer, and I'm going to moisturize and prime her face. You don't have to mix them both together. I just do this to make the step a little faster. Now I'm going to brush out her brows with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Dual Brush, number 12, and then I'm going to just prep her brows before I do them. To fill in her brows, I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Powder Duo in Chocolate. While doing this, you just want to do light strokes and fill in any sparse areas. Then after it's filled in to my liking, I'm just going to brush out her brows again. To cover her brows, I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit Bottom Row Last Shade. The brush that I'm using is just a small concealer brush. I honestly don't remember where I got this brush from. I believe I got it from Coastal Scents, but there are plenty of brushes that you can use. Now I'm going to take Revlon's Face Illuminator in Peach Light and I'm going to mix it with the Melon Pigment by MAC and I'm going to just apply that to her face. I'm only applying this to her cheekbones, her forehead, her chin, and the bridge of her nose. Then I'm going to take my IT Cosmetics highlighting brush and blend it out. I apply Fix Plus to the brush first to help it blend better. This step is what helps the face have that glowy effect. For foundation, I'm using Black Radiance Liquid Foundation in Cocoa Bean. This foundation is great for women of color and it's very affordable. I believe it retails for about $5. And the brush that I'm using to apply this is the Angle Kabuki Brush by Sigma. I actually mix Black Radiance Cocoa Bean and Black Opal's Cream Foundation Stick and Beautiful Bronze together to get this shade. To carve out the brows, I always use the leftover foundation that I use for the face. Now I'm going to highlight and contour. To highlight, I'm using Black Opal's Cream Stick Foundation in Truly Topaz with a Real Techniques angle brush. I'm applying this to her highlighted areas under her eyes, her chin, the bridge of her nose, and her forehead. Then I'm going to use my Beauty Blender to blend it all out. To blend out her contour, I'm using my It Cosmetics Sculpting Brush and my Beauty Blender. To contour, I'm going back in with Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit Bottom Row Last Shade. Now I'm going to set everything with my CoverGirl Translucent Powder in Medium. For the eyes, I'm not doing anything special. I'm just keeping them plain. So I'm just going to put MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot on top and add Black Opal's Press Powder in Medium. The Press Powder is not going to give any color and it's going to help with creasing. To wipe everything away, I'm using Sigma's F84 brush. To set her contour, I'm using Black Radiance Pressed Powder and Chocolate and Warm Hazel. I'm going over that with Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Powder and Carib.
I'm going to do finishing touches to her brows and put a brow gel over top. The brow gel that I'm using is by Anastasia Beverly Hills. To highlight, I'm going back in with Melon Pigment by MAC and I'm going to use Giella's I Am Glam Highlighter. After I highlight, I always go back in and contour a little more. I'm going to add a little bit of translucent powder under her cheekbones and apply her mascara. I'm using Maybelline's Lash Discovery Mini Brush Mascara. I'm using L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara for her top lashes. I'm going to brush away the translucent powder and contour her nose with Black Radiance Pressed Powder and Chocolate. Now to finish off her face, I'm just going to add her lipstick. And I honestly don't remember what lipstick I used. And I really don't like it either, you know, I look at it. But I'm just going to apply that and then add highlighter to her brow bone. Last but not least, I'm just going to add Fix Plus. And that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will have plenty more very soon. Promise.